Literacy and Technology Hands-On is a two-year program developed by the University of Queensland um, for adults with an intellectual disability. The program is taught twice weekly for 10 hours per week over a two-year period. The program comprises of four modules, each module lasting between 12 and 14 weeks. In 2012, Down Syndrome Ireland was granted a licence to exclusively offer the program in Ireland, the first European country to do so. The Roscommon branch is one of 13 branches offering the programme nationwide and the first county in Connacht to do so. As a parent, I feel lucky that the Latchon programme has been arranged in Roscommon, which is so close to us for travelling purposes. And on behalf of all the parents, I would like to thank the organising committee of the Down Syndrome Association in Roscommon, who have worked so hard to get this programme up and running. Certain criteria must be adhered to by the branch in order to run the programme. Our students must be over the age of 18, must have Down syndrome and be out of full-time education. Our teacher must be trained to a primary or secondary school level and undergo further training by the University of Queensland. I've always been involved in special education ever since I left college in 1977 and apart from my initial qualifications I have gained or studied for an additional one in dyslexia from Bangor University. Um, which enables me to help students who have literacy problems. I've also been trained by the Latchon team from Queensland University, so that enables me to now partake and complete courses with the students related to the Latchon scheme itself. So I had to wear something Christmassy, and look what I made for my yeah. hair. And it's the snowflakes that's reminded oh me. Oh my God, you're <laughs> serious. I am serious. Oh, I wore fabulous. that all day long. What's on it? <laughs> it is lovely. Part of the ethos of Latchon is to maintain literacy and that includes um, oral skills as well as reading skills as a lifelong learning process. And Latchon enables you to use the personal experiences of the students so that they can use that to the best of their ability. Sarah loved doing the project on advertisements and uh, it was great. Juliana took them to um, down to Tesco's and they went through the local papers and the daily papers in their classroom and it was very beneficial because when we were out shopping she was looking at different brands and different prices and she got a great lot out of that and I think that was very good for her and beneficial for her. Language and literacy are basically codes that we as individuals need to access and as the teacher within the, the group setting, it's my role to try and enable all students, no matter what level they are at, to access these codes so that they can understand either what they're saying or hearing or even what they're reading. The Latch On programme has been great for Sarah. It has really reignited her interest in reading. When she was going to school she loved reading and uh, she kind of stopped reading from once she stopped school but now Juliana has her back in the library and she's bringing home books and books of all different types, travel and everything and uh, she seems to be really enjoying reading again which is great and I'm delighted about. The mysterious travellers yeah, and it's really, it's really, really interesting, but it has loads and loads of, story, of stories on it. We try to use a, a multi-sensory approach, and it has to be structured within the classroom setting. So we're looking at sight vocabulary, words that they know, words that they can use in everyday life, and also which are related to the specific modules within Latchon. Can you put a little spot, a little dot next to the word about? Well done, Veronica. Mm -hmm. And just to help us remember them, we're going to write them now, only the ones with the dots on, one on each leaf. In addition to this, in order to extend their knowledge, we're looking at phonic work as well. So we're looking at what words might begin with, what vowel sounds you might find within them and also what word endings and this helps them to build up a bank of words, uh, a body of knowledge that will extend their skills even further. B-E-L-L. -L. Does it end in a G? No. No. Don't put a ring round it. Well done. It also has given, boosted her confidence and it's great for her work in the hub. Uh, she has a great way with the 
people when they come in to buy coffee and she has great confidence about her and definitely the programme has brought all this out in her. I think the hot seat must be a great thing in the classroom. An important element within the latch on scheme is the use of the hot seat which is done on a regular daily basis when the students are in class situation. This enables them to build their confidence up and express their own ideas and opinions in a group setting. It's quite a hard thing for them to do. They have to come out and they have to talk about something that is relevant to them. But it actually helps the reading process too because it makes all areas of literacy actually personal to their own experiences. My, my view is here. It is. This man here? Yeah. Who is he? Do you know? Yeah. I, I know who it sounds. Right. I hear from Black Eyed Peas. Yes, I think fine, yeah. Oh, it's Will I Am then, isn't it? Yeah, I think yeah. fine. It's Will I Am, yeah. Our costs are ongoing and include a €3,000 a year licence fee to latch on to run the programme. Additional costs include teacher salary, room rental, and training, and any additional materials required by the class. We do not receive any funding for the programme. All our costs must be borne by the branch and fundraising has become an integral part of what we do. I've known the group now since September. In those two months I can see a visible improvement in a variety of areas with various students. They've become more confident, their reading skills have definitely come on. Uh, particularly in a group setting where they show that they're not reluctant to read in front of other people. They will try to read unknown words and I think this is part and parcel of being able to extend their sight vocabulary and also introduce a greater level of phonic awareness. Our short-term goal is to keep the programme running locally. Our long-term hope is that the programme will be taken and delivered by the third level institutes. On behalf of the Fundraising Committee, our branch members, our service users and their families, I'd like to extend a very warm thank you to all of you for your generosity over the last few years. Our Latch On programme has taken up the bulk of our money that we have raised, but from time to time we also do other projects that that money is badly needed for. All money that we raise within the County of Roscommon, I'd like to reassure you, it stays within the County of Roscommon and it goes to very good use. I'd like to extend a very warm thank you to everybody that's here tonight, to everybody who has given up their time, who has volunteered, especially our volunteers for our Latch On programme and Juliana, our teacher. I'd like to also say thank you to those who have put up our posters, sold tickets, bought tickets, and even those people who give spot prizes. Everything counts. Everything counts on the night. Everything counts when it comes to the money that we raise and what it goes towards. Thank you to everybody. I hope you enjoy your night.